Hey everybody, this is Tina. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to share some happy mail. I'm going to share some hauls and um, the, the item, if you watch my channel earlier in the week, I said I wasn't going shopping at Tuesday morning this week because I was going to purchase something online and um, stay tuned. I'll show you what that item was. Okay, so the ha first Happy Meal that I received was from Linda, and Linda is LP Red Flower here on YouTube, and I'll leave the link down below for Linda's channel. Hi, Linda. She sent me Happy Meal, and um, I am so excited because um, I had seen this paper pad, um, someone else hauled it, and then someone told me that Linda had showed it on um, Instagram. And I went over and I told Linda, I said, oh my gosh, it's so cute. I really want to find that paper. Well, she offered to send me a package of the paper and I was so ecstatic. And then while I was waiting for Linda to send it to me, I had found um, two packs at my local Tuesday morning because I had gotten a, shop, a shopping spree of money from a friend and I went shopping and I found the panda paper. So I am thrilled that I have more than one. Now I can cut into one and hoard one. So let me just show you real quick. Show you real quick. This is the paper. It is a Panamonium kit, $2.99 at Tuesday morning. And it is so super cute. And most of you already know that pandas are my favorite animal. I absolutely love them. And the papers in this are so cute. And then this actually has a sticker pack. And I'm not sure the sticker pack is showing it's not. Let me just open it really, really quick to show you the stickers. I believe it's the last paper in here. Yep. So here's the papers are. Look at how cute. Oh my gosh. Panda heaven. I am not kidding you, you guys. So, so cute. Okay. So that was uh, the stickers that came in there. And then these are all the papers, all the different panda papers. And they even have the eucalyptus, um, bamboo, just different stuff. Really, really cute paper pad. Linda, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. And then Linda also sent me some napkins and a, a card. In her card, she just says, um, Tina, thank you for supporting me and my channel. You are a blessing, Linda. And then IP Red Flower is her YouTube channel. Um, well, Linda, you're a blessing as well. Um, I really, really appreciate you looking out and finding the paper for me and sending it because I love it so much. And then Linda sent me these beautiful bling um, flatbacks. They're like little gems and they're very blingy. Very, very pretty. And I think they'll go really well with the paper because they're black. So awesome. And then she sent me some um, napkins. So we have some really pretty birds. And there's uh, the word London on here, 1878. And look how pretty that is. It's gorgeous. And then we have this one here. And I love birds. Birds are so pretty. And here's a hummingbird. And then here's another hummingbird. And then we have some wine and grapes and cheese. And some ladybugs. Oh, this one has a different pattern. And then this one here is um, just basically like a, a blue, my favorite color um, flower and some leaves. It's really pretty. So, Linda, thank you, thank you so much for that. You were so thoughtful and so kind, and I really, really appreciate it. Okay, and then I got a happy mail from P, who is Whimsical Endeavor here on YouTube. And, of course, you guys, I could not wait to open the package. So, um, it was really wrapped cute in this little Valentine's tissue. And it was tied up with the red and white jupe. And I'll be keeping that for another project or put it on my, um, in my stash. And, um, P has sent me this cute little postcard. Now the heart was stuck on there like that. Isn't that cute? And the heart is like a felt, really pretty felt. And the paper has little tiny hearts in it. So she sent me that. 
she sent me some uh, mix, some uh, shaker bits, and so pretty. Now, um, P, I didn't know, do you uh, mix your own and make your own different mixes? Because um, this is really, really pretty. It's um, the blues, the teals. It's got uh, gold little stars, and it also has, like, glitter in it. So it's purple, blue, really, really pretty. I love that. So she sent me that one, and she sent me this one. This is a purple and um, looks like a, a beige, maybe purple, beige, gold hearts. I mean, gold stars and glitter. So that one reminds me of unicorns. It's so pretty. And she also sent me a card. And look how pretty this card is. It says, you're amazing. Or you are so amazing. I love that. I love the colors. And because it, it's like an ombre on this side of the card is white. And then it goes into like a peachy color. And then it gets darker. Really pretty. And she's put these little um, stars in iridescent on the front of that card. I don't know. Is it picking it up? Can you see them? Really, really cute. And P is just saying to me, Tina, thank you very much. Thank you for everything. You always make me smile. Hugs P. Oh, P, you always make me smile too. And then she put this really cute paper in the bottom. Love the card. Thank you, P. And then she also gifted me, I love these panda um, note cards. Um, not new note cards. Um, sticky notes. And uh, Grace, I think it was Grace who gave me a pack of these. And I use them all the time. So thank you so much. Now I have another one um, to keep in my desk. So thank you for those, P. And she also sent me a Penny Black stamp. And P, I'm not sure, but I think I might already have this one. Um, if I do, if it's all right with you, I'll keep this one because I haven't used mine yet. And I'll gift mine away. So it's a cute little polar bear and a little hedgehog and they have cups of coffee and the steam's coming up and it says hug in a mug and then it says for you. So super cute. I love Penny Black. I really, really love Penny Black stamps. They're a little pricey, but I mean, um, they're good quality. So look at that. Isn't that adorable? Sharing a little cup of coffee with his little friend. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much, P. That was so sweet of you to send me a little happy mail. Um, and I didn't know that I didn't know that was coming, so that was um a surprise. Okay, and then I went to um MFT had um a vault opening and uh they had some things that were past releases that they had put in the vault that were um uh retired and they brought them back out and they were only available for a certain time. So I picked up three of the images um they had others but i i was trying to control myself and um i didn't buy any of the stamps over 17 18 dollars but i did buy the pure innocence and they're a little cheaper but i i did not ever get this one and i'm so happy they brought this back because this is right up my alley <laughs> so she's a little cute little um farmer girl in her overalls cute little hay bale a little piggy and some little chickens and then um, the sentiments say, hey there, and how's it growing? So cute. I love it. I love it, love it. And then this one, I've never seen this one before. And this is called Love in the Air. And um, this one's adorable too. And it's perfect for Valentine's or even just any time. I was thinking Mother's Day too, because you could send your mom a card and tell her how much you love her and... Um, all the little hearts are above her head and she's got her arms all out. You know how they say, I love you this much. Well, it looks like that's what she's saying. I love you this much. And she's got her arms all stretched out. So, um, her sentiments are love is in the air. Love you. And let me show, let me shower you with love. So she's super cute as well. And then I picked this one up and I, um, I think I did see this when it came out, but I don't think I grabbed it at the time. Or maybe she was actually in a set. That's right. She was in a set, a $17 set. And then they took her out 
and made just a stamp of her and so cute and this is called green pastures again right up in my alley she's got a cute little outfit on like she's on the farm and she's got her little hat adorable and she has sentiments to say howdy and wishing you green pastures and aw shucks i missed your birthday so cute i love these stamps so i got those that's what i got from mft now this is what i was purchasing um in you know in replace of going to tuesday morning but i ended up going to tuesday morning anyway because i was blessed with uh shopping money so um so this is from stampin up and this is the stamparatus um i wanted this since it came out i just haven't bit the bullet and actually bought it um and grace was having a party i believe it ends this wednesday the 29th of january um she's having a party with kimbo creations and there's a hostess code so if you want to purchase anything and use her hostess code you can get entered into her extra giveaway and then also you'll be entered into kim's um drawings her monthly drawings um and you can purchase whatever you want it, it can come from the clearance section or whatever it is as long as you purchase something with her hostess code you will get entered into um her giveaway okay so i got the stamp apparatus and i and i have to tell you guys i'm a little surprised at the size i don't know what i was thinking i mean i like the size but i don't know what i was thinking i i thought to myself that this was bigger than it actually is and it's it's not um which is fine because it's a perfect size it'll fit on um my desk uh you know without taking up too much space so you get the bottom half some of you might already know what this is and you probably already have one um, so you get the bottom half, it comes with the foam and then the grid. Okay. And then, um, you have the two doors and I haven't put them on yet. And I don't know if there's a number or if they are labeled to which one goes where, but, um, it just slides right in like that. You see that? I don't want to get you, get you too much in the glare or, um, you know, blind you. And then you put the other one on the other side. Okay. And then that one closes down. Wait a minute. I don't know if I have it right here. Yeah. I, I think... I think what happens is it's um it's pushed up a little bit because I'm trying to close it with the other one on top. Um but these are used um the two door system is used for um when you are um two step three step stamping. This is why I wanted it because I have a Misty but it just um it has the one door that closes down. This one's going to allow you to do the two step you know, when you have to stamp down um, the first image and it could be like lighter or, or lesser. And then you do the second one in a different color or even, um, you know, a different shade or whatever. And then you could do both with the doors the way they open and close. So there is a demonstration um, on uh, Stampin' Up! website. But um, yeah, I was so thrilled to be able to get this this time around. And it does come with two magnets. On the bottom there's magnet holders there's one there and one there and it comes with the rubber feet so once it's down on your desk it's not going to move while you're trying to stamp so absolutely am thrilled and i can't wait to try this out and so that's what i was purchasing you guys and uh i got it with Dra uh, grace's uh code and then the last thing i got today in the mail was my magnifying glass i told you guys i went to amazon and this is the one that I picked up um, for my jewelry making uh, or charm making so I can actually see the jump rings. So this one is called a foldable magnifier. And so it folds up, but it also, um, you could take it out and use it with your hand and put it down in your project like that. It does have an LED light. Um, I don't know, um, let me see. So this is it here. You gotta figure out how to, how it goes all this packaging so i guess 
it's going to be like this and you would just tighten it up. I think there's a, um, yeah, so it's tightened up like that. And then you can see, you can loosen it up and move it, but here's the magnifying part and it does have the um, light in it. So let me real quick, if I can do this. I never can open these things. I don't know about you guys, but um, yeah, there we go. It calls for three AAA batteries. So let me just real quickly put these batteries in here. Okay, so we have this one going down this one and then this one goes this way oh yeah look at that oh wow that's awesome okay so let me get the cover back on nope didn't go on right there we go oh yes this is awesome so you can um you can look at it through here this way or you can take it off like i said you can um it says that you can just take it off here so i'm guessing you just pull this whoops whoops i dropped it um you just pull this out and then pick it up so you could use it like this yourself and hold it like that so Awesome. I love it. I love the lights and I think this is going to help big time um, with my jewelry making. So that's it, you guys. That is my haul and my happy mail for today. I want to wish you all a good day. God bless and thanks for watching. Thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe and come back to see some more and we will see you next time. Bye, everybody.